muscles here with some hip circles. So grab those hips. Make sure you have a band and some dumbbells for today's workout because we're going to be using yeah. all of that as we work these core muscles. But let's spin it around and around for three, two, two one. one. And other direction, two. spinning it around and around, two. really finding some range of motion through those hips. As you spin it, let's go three, two, one. And now let's just go from side to side. Let's drop those arms and start to warm up these side obliques. Again, just bending nice and lightly through as far of motions as you can. And we'll go three, two, really reach down, a one, and excellent job. Now bring your arms out just like this. Slightly bend your knees, and we're going to turn this way. And we'll go this way. Again, let's turn this way. And this way. And we'll go six. And five. Good work. And four. Squeeze your core. Three. Two. Last one. Let's going to get that heart rate going. Let's get the blood pumping here with a nice little march. And we'll go ten. Nine, again, lift your legs up nice and high for six, five, four, three, two, one. And a nice little job here for three, two, one. Excellent job. Now I want you to bring your right arm or whichever arm, your outside arm, straight up over your head. So bring it all the way up. Now I want you to use your chair if you have to, and we're going to tilt this way. We're going to take a deep breath in. We're going to exhale and tilt, inhale, stand up tall, exhale and tilt, inhale, stand up tall, one more time, exhale and tilt, inhale, stand up tall, now with that same outside leg, we're going to work on some balance, so I want you to bring this leg up and bring it down, bring it up, bring it down, bring it up, bring it down, bring it, down. Bring it up. Bring it down, see if you can balance here and squeeze that core, bring it up and down two more, bring it up and down. Now last one, bring it up and down. Now we're gonna repeat those. Now bring this arm up again, all the way up, stretching and inhale. And exhale to the side, inhale up tall. Exhale to the side, you can feel that pulling here and here. Inhale up, this is working those obliques. Exhale to the side. One more time. Inhale it up. Exhale to the side. Again, feel the stretch and inhale up. Exhale your arm down. Now to those leg raises. Let's bring it up and down. Again, bringing it up and down. Again, squeeze those muscles. Work these muscles right here. Bring it up and down. Four more. Bring it up. And down, keep going, and up, and down, two more, and up, and down. Now hold it up, and really focus on squeezing this outside area. Put your hand right there and squeeze it. Even if you hold out of the chair, it's still working. And three, two, one, bringing it down. Now let's just kind of march it here before we go to the other side. And let's go three, two, one. Now I want you to grab onto one dumbbell before we switch to the other side so grab on to just one and when you have that holding it in the same outside right here we're going to reach down and let's bring it up let's reach down and let's bring it back this way you have work you're going to really feel in the stretches here yeah. and come up tall and let's bring it down and up tall a little bit this way again bringing it this way and up tall in this way, three more, bring it down, and bring it back, good work, bring it down, and back, and then one more here, down, bring it back, now grab onto that dumbbell like this, slightly bend those knees, let's just raise it up at an angle in front of us, let's go up, and down, bring it up, down, bring it up, down, now hold it up and engage your core, squeeze those uh, ab muscles, squeeze your back, and three, two, one, excellent job, bring it down, I'm just kind of march here to loosen everything up, and we'll go three, two, one, and excellent job, now let's set down this dumbbell, I'm going to 
to move my chair the other side because we are going to go through those exercises right from here. Now, first things first, we're going to raise this outside arm up. So bring it up and inhale. Exhale, let's tilt this way. Inhale, bring it up. Exhale, tilt this way again, only as far as you can. Inhale, stretch up. Exhale, bring it to the side. Inhale, up tall. One more here. Exhale, bring it down and feel that stretch right through here. And inhale, up. Exhale, that arm. Let's go to the side raise. Let's bring it up and down again. Activate your core here. And down, bringing it up. And down, put on a smile. Bring it down again, bringing it up. And down three more, bring it up. And down, keep going, bringing it up. And down, last one, bring it up. And down, now inhale this arm again, inhaling it up. Stretching and exhale to the side for what is comfortable. Inhale it up. Exhale to the side. Inhale it up, good work. Exhale to the side. More here, inhale. Exhale, really feel the stretch there for three, two, one. Inhale it up, reaching into the ceiling. Now exhale that arm. Side raises here. Let's bring it up and bring it down. Good work, bringing it up and down again, bringing it up and down five more and up and down and bringing it up and down. Remember, we're going to hold it on the last one and down. We got two more here up and down now hold it up really focus on squeezing this area again use your chair if you have to but tighten it up for three two keep squeezing one bring it down let's just march those legs and three two one now let's grab onto that dumbbell again and once you have it we're just going to start with the side the sides again this way and reach it back and standing up tall in between each position here, again, reaching down and across. Again, take a deep breath in and exhale. Again, always keeping your shoulders back, your body as straight as possible. And we got five. Bring it back, good work, and four. Bring it back, and I'm really feeling that burn right in those sides. Three, keep going, and two. Same thing, we're going to lightly squat down, we're going to raise it up at an angle, so let's bring it up, down, bringing it up, down, good work, up, down, now hold it up and engage that core, engage your glutes, and engage your back, and hold it, three, two, one, bringing it down, let's march those legs again, and we'll go three, two, one, excellent job, now set down your dumbbell. And I want you to grab onto your resistance band, and we are going to continue to work these side obliques with resistance bands seated down. So have a seat. Whenever you're ready, we'll just march here until you have that band. So we're going to march for about 15 seconds here. So get ready. And we'll go 10, 9, 8, good work, 7, 6, and 5, 4, 3, 2, one, and let's run it out here nice and quick. You can kind of move your body, loosen it all up, and we'll go three, two, one, and excellent job. Now take this band, wrap it around the tops and the bottoms of your feet, and I will take my time as well. So once you got it on, so let's see, we're going to start with some outs and ins here. So we're going to go out and in, out and in again. Sit up as straight as you can, tighten your core. As your legs go out, you will feel those ab muscles tighten up. And let's go out and in, out and in. Now let's slow it down here. Let's bring it up and let's slowly bring it out. Let's bring it up. We'll slowly bring it in. One more time with that side. Up and slowly out, engaging that core. Up and slowly and again, excellent job with that. Let's do the other side. Again, bringing it up, slowly moving it out, up, and slowly bringing it in. Good work. Bring it up and out, up, and in. Excellent job with that. Now, arms come up just like this. We're going to 
alternate and bicycle. So let's go this way. And we'll go this way again, slow and controlled here. And we'll go this way and that way. And let's go this way and that way. Let's slow it down even more. We'll go 10. Good work. Nine. Really concentrate here. Eight. No burden. Seven. Again, slow and controlled. Six. Sorry. 
everybody. Excellent job with that. That's going to stretch out these hamstrings, bring this leg forward. Let's reach out down, feeling that stretch again. Maybe fan yourself off a little bit. See if you can touch that toe. Hold it for three, two, one. Excellent job. Other side, bringing it down. Stretching, feeling the stretch behind that leg. And we'll go five, four, three, touch the toe, two, one, and excellent job. Now let's stand up to finish the rest of our stretches. So stand up. And we're gonna point the chair right here. We're gonna use the chair, we're gonna bring our legs back. We're gonna stretch out that back. We're gonna push our hips back. Keep our legs straight, drop our head between our arms. Feel the stretch throughout the backs of those legs and that back. We'll go three, two, one. Let's slowly come on up. Now with that, we're going to be standing. Let's go through a nice front crawl here. So again, we're just going to loosen everything up. Through this motion here, nice and slow. And we'll go five, four, three, two, one, and back. Crawl around and around, and we'll go three, two, one. Let's drop those arms from side. Let's stretch these out here from side to side, and we'll go three, two, one more on the other side. And excellent job. Let's just crisscross those arms here, and we'll go three, two. One and again, excellent job with that workout. Now I'd love to know in the comments below if you can feel some of those side oblique muscles. But I wanted to talk a little bit about this. Now, when you use these bands often, yeah, to drive, so yeah. good work out there. I got a good sweat going.